Megan from Smart Kids Piano, and today we're going to play Under the Sea from The Little Mermaid. All right, so our hands are in kind of an unusual position for this song. Um, I'm just going to walk you up from the bottom. So put your left hand pinky, your finger five on G, that's right under middle C, and then we'll have A, B, C, and D in the left hand. So G, A, B, C, D. And then our right hand is going to start right next to that and just continue going up. So we have E. And then finger two is actually playing an F sharp. So have that black key there. And then G, A, and B. All right, so we need all those different notes under our hands. Okay, so for now, we're gonna learn that first part of the song that goes like this. And then it's the same thing again. So let me walk you through that. So we have um, four G's in a row. So G, 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 G. Uh -huh. And then we go to F sharp, A, G, D. So after those G's, we had F sharp with our two, skip up to A, back to G, and then left hand, thumb. Okay, so let's kind of put that together. So the words there, it says... Seaweed is always greener. So you know that part, don't you? That's really familiar. Let's do it together. Yeah, do that with me again. The seaweed is always greener. Yeah, and then we've got a little set of left hand notes. In somebody else's lake. So B to D. So let's try to put that beginning part together. So starting on those four G's in a row. The seaweed is always greener in somebody else's lake. That's it. Yeah, so, so go ahead and stop the video and practice that a bit if you need to. The good news is we do it two times in a row. So once you've done that one time, you just have to do it all over again. So um, just same notes, different words. You dreamed about going up there, but that is a big mistake. Yeah, so see, it's the same thing again. Do you want to try to play that with me? We'll do it twice in a row, and I'll go slow with you. That's it. Yeah, so have fun practicing that and join me in part two and I'll show you the next bit. I'll see you there. Hey, it's Megan, your piano teacher. I have a lot of fun teaching you piano lessons and don't forget that you kind of have to go slow sometimes. You won't learn how to play the piano really quickly overnight. You just have to take your time and do your best and it'll come with time. So have fun practicing.